All right, it's Little Friday and we're coming up on 930. We are so glad you're here with us. We have a lot going on in this half hour. You're going to meet some very interesting people. And I want you to log on, WBTV.com slash vote. Yes, we're glad you're here. It's a special day, Kristen. A big day today. Mm. It is National Men Make Dinner Day. But important rules here. Grilling doesn't count. They need to be in the kitchen. And so Jeff Tony Dandel, who knows his way around the kitchen, is joining us in the QC kitchen. How are you? Oh, I'm excellent today. This well, is a fun day. It's a fun day. I want to note, too, of course, Jeff uh, and his wife, Jamie Brown, have the Tony Dandel Brown Restaurant Group. So you know these restaurants. Haberdish, Growler's Poorhouse, Everondolo, Raining Donuts. You guys are working on Leluya Hall. Working so you, on you Leluia both Hall. are kind of really familiar with the kitchen. Yeah, and today we're going to showcase some steak from um, Supperland. This isn't a cut we have there, but um, we do all prime and Wagyu steaks there, and this is a little more approachable cut that I think you could do at home. All right, we're going to get into the recipe in a second. I first have to ask, who, who does make dinner at your house? I don't get to make <laughs> dinner as much as I would like to make dinner. So I Why is that? going to take... No, no, go ahead and answer honestly. Um, <laughs> there's lots of reasons, but, um, you know, we'll, we'll get into that. But, okay, um, okay. Jamie does a wonderful job yeah. um, feeding the kids, feeding me, mm. and... Um, we're all over the place. With yeah, how do you keep up with all that? With the whole yeah, fam so and then all these restaurants, yeah, exactly. right? Exactly. So we got we got a lot going on. Okay, so let's jump in then. You said this is because steak's so big at Supperland. This is you'll have yeah. So this family. is a really approachable cut. It's called a skirt steak. We have this one cut in half mm -hmm. so that we can have a, a demo um, steak over there. Okay. But the important thing to notice on this, yep, is this is really the only thing you can mess up. This is why we're doing the steak. Is super easy. Okay. As you see the grain running here, yes. going this way. Yes. You have to slice it against the grain when you get done. Or Why else is that? The grain will get like it, that's like the tough part of the meat and it'll get stuck in your teeth and it, it makes it chewy and ah. so if you just slice it that way, that is really all you need to know for the skirt steak. So it's going to be super easy. That's but very let's, interesting. Let's good to the, know. Let's get this thing started. Yeah, we see that. So and it has smelled so good in I the I like kitchen. salting our steaks. We do this at Supperland, too, at least four hours beforehand. Oh, wow. So we usually overnight the day before yeah. salt all of the steaks and let that penetrate the meat mm -hmm. versus doing like kind of a wet marinade. Yeah. But this, the salt you'll actually see will seep in mm -hmm. and there'll be like a little bit of water on top and then it drains back into the steak as it as it evens out. So okay. anyways, so here we go. We're just gonna put right. this in the pan. Okay. And is that just so regular olive oil in there? Just a little bit of olive oil. Uh -huh. And so then you want your pan, you see how our pan's kind of smoking pretty hot. You want yeah. your pan very hot. And then we're just gonna go two minutes here. Mm-hmm. Okay, so two minutes, super easy. Great. And then the other thing I think the most important part mm -hmm. about this um, as men are making dinner tonight yes is to cook really clean yeah like, uh, that's like the most respectful thing i think you can do on a night like this yep and so for me it is empty the dishes before you start cooking don't just run into the kitchen and start making everything yes. empty the dishes give yourself a clean dishwasher to be throwing all your stuff into yeah and then you know put it on the fast cycle so it's even done by the time uh, dinner's You're ready. You're setting us up well for men make right. dinner day here. It, exactly, yes, I exactly. like this. I like so this. So the only other thing we did, just to um, keep it fresh, this meat's super versatile. You can use it in tacos. Uh -huh. You can just put some potatoes on the side and slice it and eat it like a steak. It's, yeah. it's really, really wonderful. Or you can put it on a stir fry. So there's a million different things we can do with this mm -hmm. steak over here. Um, so I just made, just like to keep everything fresh. So we just have some cilantro here yeah. and some parsley. The only thing you can really mess up with this gremolata is not rinsing your cilantro. Oh. Cilantro is grown in sand, and if you don't get all that sand off there, huh. I've done that before. I didn't know that. That yes. is very so smart. Okay. We just have um, some lemon there and uh, just a little bit of the peel, and then it is just parsley and cilantro, and then we'll just mix this up. So there's our kind of uh, steak topper. Yeah. Um, so that's it. You know, that's all, all we have Wonderful. to do. If you were making this in your home tonight, what sides would you add? I know you mentioned potatoes. Would you add anything else on the side too? I would do, I would probably roast a vegetable and we love roasted vegetables in the oven. Mm -hmm. So we do a lot of sheet tray, oh, um, Brussels yeah. sprouts, carrots, um, cauliflower, all those things, you, olive oil, salt, pepper, mm -hmm. maybe finish with a little bit of lemon or apple cider vinegar, um, depending on what vegetable it is, oh. just to kind of balance it out. But we love doing that, and yeah. that's kind of the kind of the key. So awesome. here we are. We're two minutes in. Yep. 
And, and so flip. you'll see. Oh, look at so that. That's, that's all you got to do. And then you set a timer for another two minutes. Uh huh. And then we can come Voila. over here. Yeah, we got about a minute left. And uh, all right, so even on this one, so after you cook your steak, two minutes, two minutes, let it rest mm -hmm. about eight, ten minutes. Okay. And then this is what we're left with. But look, I'm turning it yep. sideways yep. here. Go against right the grain. Against the grain here. Okay. So then, now, I'll just slice right in the middle here mm -hmm. just to kind of get a good picture. Oh, but wow. you see, yeah. so we have that. And then you just keep, you just keep slicing away. And this is like medium, right? This is medium. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so you want it just a little pink in the middle. But you can cook it however you want to cook it. Yeah. But, um, and then we would just kind of shingle it out. Yeah. All nice on your on your board, and yeah. then have your potatoes and your vegetables and everything all set. And then if you want, um, if you, we got to salt this one ahead of time, so uh -huh. we don't really need a whole lot of salt. But if you want, we can have our nice little garnish here. Oh yes, do the garnish. I'm going to put the information for Supperland up on the screen here. Of course, as I mentioned when we got so, started, they have so many restaurants. A little bit of salt to finish here. We'll just sprinkle on top. Yes. And then let me. Have a, uh, Look at that glove here. Of course, we will have this on the QC Kitchen app as well. That is free. It's in your app store or your Google and then Play just store. Get a little yeah. of the freshness and the greens in there, and um, and you're all set. That's really as simple as that. All you, you made it look super easy. Will you cut me just a little piece because I just want to grab a piece here we real fast before we finish up. We'll get you okay. a nice, a, the best piece, the best the cut here, best and then we'll cut a really piece. great one for Kristen too. I, I know, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> I, 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 brought, I brought two forks. Oh, mm, thank you. Mm. See? Yeah. How is it? We, I bet it's so we, good. We know. Mm. We know how Kristen is. Well done. Congratulations. They did. <laughs> no. Thank you so much. No, thanks for coming in the QC Kitchen for Midnight Dinner. Just Network. have fun making dinner for have friends, fun. loved ones, family tonight. Let's mm -hmm. do it. Oh, that was that looks so good. So Thank good. you guys so Over much. You. Mm, it smells so good in here.